Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 17 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 84 rated SBC Fernandinho. So in seven matches from the centre mid position, he managed to score me nine goals and get me two assists, which is absolutely amazing. Um, now we're getting into some of his in-game stats. As you can see, he has 90 aggression, 90 interceptions, 78 vision, 71 um, crossing. 83 dribbling, 85 long pass, 84 shot power, I'm sorry long shot, What you will see a lot of long shots in this video, um, he has 4 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves and his main positions are centre mid and CDM, although looking at his card stats you could probably also play in, in the cam position. So now getting into his pros, his first pro is long shots and this is probably the biggest seller of this card, the main reason you should probably do the SBC is because of his long shots. This guy's long shots are honestly incredible. I would even say on par with team of the season Ericsson. And as you know, he had insane long shots. If you haven't seen that review already, I will leave it at the end of this video so you can go and check it out. So yeah, that's his first selling point. His long shots are incredible. Most of the goals in this video you will see from him are long shots. The next pro is box to box and if you're looking for you know a box to box midfielder you know Kante is a very good box to box midfielder but personally I actually prefer this card over one to watch Kante. I'm not really sure about his you know team of the season card or um yeah team or player of the season card because I haven't really tried that card out but over 85 rated one to watch Kante and his normal card this card is definitely 100 times better um, you know just because he's got extra things such as long shots as well as you know the defensive work rates that Kante has and then the final pro I could find with this card was his dribbling this guy's keeps the ball so close to his feet it's really good you know midfield when he's surrounded by you know a lot of players he's really good at getting out of you know tight small um, spaces and then you know playing the pass through to the strikers or the wingers and he's also good you know taking on players as you see here running past a load of players playing a nice three ball there to player with the mumps on who luckily for us couldn't finish it and then the only con I could find with this card was his height if you're looking for you know that sort of player who's going to win all the aerial battles this guy is not the player for you um, but you know in a centre mid position is sort of alright you know if you're looking to play him in more of a CDM role maybe he's not going to be the guy for you but if you're looking to play him in a centre mid position he will be completely fine so as you can see in this re review as well I'm sort of including not just goals I'm also including a lot of you know um and like assists he's got and dribbles he went on just because I think you know it makes you guys get a better you know idea of what this card is like so as you can see here showing off his pace there playing a nice one two there with Ericsson running through on gold and look at that for a very cheeky finish over Butland there he came running out just a cheeky dink over the keeper very very nice goal there and he has actually perfect work rates in my opinion for a centre midfielder he has medium attack high defensive so this means you know he will join in with the attack but not go too far forward and he will also be there you know in front of your defence um, to give them you know the extra wall in front of the defence um, so yeah so there, as you can see here we get a really nice assist here do a nice driven shot um, driven uh, cross there um, to um, Gabriel Jesus who does a really nice finish and this is a really nice long shot again there from Fernandinho um, does some nice dribbling there to a ball roll and then smashes it into the bottom corner past the goalkeeper so guys this has been the review if you have enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and see you next time bye